Hey, what's going on guys? Uh, welcome to another video. I uh, wanted to open some Johnny Lightning um, CRXs today. I recently got a, a, a new color into my collection, so I wanted to open that. Um, show you guys what the car looks like and uh, discuss a little bit about Johnny Lightning 164 cars. Um, these are the two I have in my collection so far. Uh, I have the uh, red one and the uh, this one's actually a they call it a Taishan green I think it should be a little lighter though. I think it's a little dark, but yeah, this is the uh, Taishan green um, Honda CRX's so uh, I'm gonna be showing you guys uh, The previous releases while I go ahead and uh, crack open the new one that I have the new one that I have is a color I've been looking for for a long time just because um, uh, I used to drive this color uh, car for a little while, so let me open this for you guys while you guys take a look at the red one. The red one's probably one of my, I don't know, it's one of, it used to be my favorite up until I got the Taishan Green, but uh, this one was actually a store release. One of the only store released Honda CRXs that's come out by Johnny Lightning so far. Uh, they've been really doing Miho exclusives for uh, this casting ever since, actually. But uh, yeah, so this one I found at Walmart. I think this one came out back in 2018. Um, yeah, so Johnny Lightning, you gotta love it or you hate it, actually. Um, as you can see by this one, there's details, but the details aren't as strong as um or as 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 yeah as strong as like other brands are but i mean it's reflected on the price point though um the 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 details are are painted for johnny lightning i don't think i've ever seen a uh, lens or clear uh, uh separate pieces for the uh other body parts of the car so i mean you know it, it still looks fantastic uh this one in particular looks good actually i think the wheel stance is pretty decent um but i'll I might have, i'll show you this green one in a little bit but uh yeah this one has a gray interior uh overall it's pretty big i would say it's more of like a 155 maybe or 157 scale it's rather rather large uh, but I mean, if you're going to display them next to Hot Wheels, it, it does look good. I do have it displayed next to some Hot Wheels, so it does look good. So that's the red one. I, it's a, a dark, you know, maroon maybe. This one's the Taishan Green. Um, like I said, my personal favorite probably. I don't know, maybe this new one's my favorite. But uh, as you guys can tell by this one, a big problem with Johnny Lightning is the... Uh, the stance of the wheels are kind of not accurate a lot of the times. Um, Hot Wheels sometimes has a has a uh, problem with this as well, but you can kind of tell going through the front there, like the wheels are just in too much. Um, it, it does make the car not as realistic to me, and it is a, a rather large flaw for me, but... I don't know why I keep buying this casting. I do enjoy it though. I just, something about it, like just the silhouette of the body to me looks great. And you know, Johnny Lightning does have their QC issues, but I mean, overall, I think it looks, I think it's fantastic. So that's the uh, blue one, Taisha Green, I'm sorry. Uh, I mean, details are fine. Um, it does have white. I do like that this one does have a white paint for the headlights whereas the uh the red one has uh gray kind of as you can see there um the white one has white so it does look more realistic and it does have painted like side markers and um and uh the tail uh, the turn signals in the front are painted so it has enough detail to where you know it's 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 nice to enjoy you know to look at and you know and and then Another pro about Johnny Lightning is they do roll, so they do roll rather well. So I mean, if that's a if that's a if that's a requirement for you, then I recommend you know um, Johnny Lightning metal bases, of course. And another thing to note about Johnny Lightning is they don't always use um, they don't always use uh, rubber uh, wheels, tires, I should say. A, they kind of go for more of a realistic look. So if they have to use a, a tire or a wheel choice that they don't have in rubber yet, then that's what they'll do. Is what I was 
wasn't heard, I think, when I was watching one of their videos. So, yeah, I mean, to me, it's not that big of a deal as long as the wheel is nice and detailed. You know what I mean? So, like, as you can see here, this one's plastic, but the wheels do look nice and detailed. They're kind of like see-through, not like Hot Wheels. Uh, where it's like kind of like a one plastic non-see-through wheel. So, all right, those are the two I have. Uh, I'm gonna. I just ripped open this one. Um, well, uh, while you guys were, while I was talking about the other two, like I said, I've been on the hunt for a yellow one. I saw it in store uh, at a hobby dealer for a really good price. So I, I was so excited. I get excited for stupid things like that. I, it doesn't have to be a chase for me. I, if it's a color of, of a car I really like, then once I see it, it's like, oh heck yeah. I really, I really do like that. So, all right, let's take a look at this yellow one. Man, the lighting's just, it's kind of gloomy out there today where I live in Cali, so there you go. All right, let's take a look at the yellow one. Um, I just kind of look over the paint and make sure everything looks nice and pretty, yeah, I mean, a lot of my big complaint about Johnny Lightning is QC. So yeah, it's it's good to see that like, you know, the black lining isn't like rubbed off on the yellow. That's always been an issue with me is like the black rubbing off to the yellow and just not looking sharp overall. But whew, this one looks great actually. This probably is gonna be my next favorite, my next uh, new favorite color. Uh, fun fact about Johnny Lightning is they're easy to do wheel swaps. Wait, they used to be able to just, I used to just be able to just take the whole wheel off, but I don't know, maybe they changed it. I'll have to show you guys in another video, but yeah, though there's some giant lightnings where you could just, uh, you could just pull the, uh, the whole wheel hub thing off and then just replace it with another wheel that you like, but maybe they got rid of that. This is kind of a newer, um, Johnny lightning. So yeah, it looks great. I mean, overall details are the same. There's really no point in me, um, like going over it again but I'll, I'll let it spin around for you guys and uh show you guys so yeah let me know what you guys think about johnny lightning i do have other johnny lightnings uh in my collection man i'm sorry guys but i just have to say one more time that yellow is just fantastic my god it really does look great I, i'm really happy i got this one but yeah let me know what you guys think about johnny lightning they they're coming out with newer castings here and there so uh, I'm kind of interested about that, uh, the, the FB RX-7. I kind of want to pick that up and take a look at that. But yeah, let me know what you guys think. John Lightning is not a, a perfect brand, of course. You know, they have their own issues that I, you know, like I, I think I've already verbalized pretty well during the video. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know what favorite color uh, your CRX is. I don't know if you guys collect this casting or not, but if you do, let me know what favorite color yours is. And uh, if you don't, let me know. Maybe you'll be convinced to go pick some up now. But they're pretty cheap on eBay, like 10, 15 bucks. So, all right, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. God bless you guys. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.